digital has got the potential to disrupt every industry in the world. And oil and gas is no exception. Today's event, we're going to be joined by up to 100 external guests from many different industry sectors, but all working in the digital space. We have deliberately made this event different. It's not about giving people what BP is doing, it's about inviting them into challenging conversations about some of the exciting questions that face us in the future. We want to hear what other industries are doing, so it's about opening our doors and collaborating. What is the people have that we don't have in BP? What's great about them that we can learn from? How do they operate in a different way to the way that we operate? The broader the talent we can get in and through the door, the more we stand to learn. Ultimately, it's about the ideas and the relationships that will get built today that I think is particularly exciting. We really have an aspiration to be the digital leader in our industry, but we don't have all the answers. We know we don't have all the answers, and that's why we're here today. Imagine if this man's footsteps could power the lights in this city. I think, wow, that's, that's the future that technology needs to bring. If you want to transform, you have to be disruptive. And you have to do it at a fast, fast pace, because if you don't do it, someone else will. How do you stay on top of the change curve? First hour and a half of my day is reading blogs and reading Fantastic. literature every single day. This used to take me 10 hours, now it's taking me two hours. And I'm not being stressed to do more things now. I can actually think for eight hours, what does that mean? And how can I make the team better? The notion of putting sensors all over your rig and then exposing that data to people who can create creative, innovative applications to solve problems is probably fundamentally the, the, the crux of the opportunity around digitization. We are building the connected upstream. The connected upstream is going to be connected to everything else before long. So what that leads to is transparency is a given. At very early days, everyone that joined Uber was actually made to learn about databases. It's about having that data-driven decision-making. We took great learning from other sectors and other industries. We had the automotive industry, we had space, we had subsea, uh, we had nuclear. Um, and I think in terms of remote operations, there's some great learning that I think you know we could do in collaboration with BP. My aspiration today was to say that BP is a progressive company it's showing respect to others by inviting other people's opinions. And BP is a company that's actually taking a position out in the future. The innovation that was here and the ability for people to really create solutions to problems, it was a really exciting environment to be within. Helping transform the way BP runs operations, tracks operations, transforming the way BP uses technology for exploration. I think there's a lot of potential for partnership and working together. It's good to see that the big companies are just as innovative and just as quick thinking and are on it as much as we are. This has been a great day because there's a lot of energy in a subject that's almost universally changing everyone's world. So it's exciting to be with like-minded people that want to tackle the future the way we do.